I'm Leah, I'm 21 years old and I'm from England. So in this restaurant, mm. the fish is pretty good. So yeah. you can try different way of cooking fish, like sashimi, fried fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah something yeah. like that. So I hope you will like it. Must be delicious. All right. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I want to trust, trust your sense. All right. <laughs> also, they have like a beef. Beef. So you can try beef. <laughs> Every time I have to say I have a nuts allergy, usually they're like, oh, we have some nuts oil or something, so they always have to change the food. For um, me. If you eat nuts, then like, what's going to happen to your body? <laughs> so, like, my lips will yeah. go blue and then I can't breathe because it happened before when I was a child in school. Uh, it's too hot, so I have nekojita. <laughs> 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 Must wait about five minutes. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Do you like Japanese tea? Uh, yeah, I like Japanese tea. I like ocha. Ocha, green yeah. tea. Green tea, and I like matcha, mm. everything. How long have you been in Tokyo? Uh, almost two years. Almost two years? Yeah, but my Japanese is poor. <laughs> After two years, <laughs> like my listening is really good, mm. but speaking is terrible. Oh, uh, what made you come to Japan? Uh, I really like uh, Japanese history. Uh -huh. Called Shimizawa Echi. He's really cool. Uh -huh. <laughs> I like Japanese art. Uh -huh. um, Mubikami Takashi. Uh, I like Japanese culture and fashion. Mm. I think Japan is the most trendiest place in like all of the world for fashion. Oh yeah? <laughs> yeah, really. There's such a big culture of vintage fashion. Yeah, oh. it's so good. I love it. <laughs> Especially like uh, in this area, mm. uh, Sando Aoyama area, you can yeah. see full of like uh, small shops. Yeah, Ichijoji and Shimoki Tozawa and Koenji, they're so good for vintage places. Oh. So. Looks delicious. Mm. I have so much. <laughs> Beef salad. This spoon. spoon. <gasps> ah, to get the rice. Yeah. Mm. It's really good. And ginger and wasabi too. So the fish? And grouper. Mm. Oh, it's really, really good. Delicious. Is it like a good amount of wasabi you put? Or I need more. more. <laughs> it keeps disappearing. <laughs> I love wasabi. It's so good. And this one? Um, you should try. She said like a grouper. <laughs> Chewy. Oh wow, a lot of wasabi. <laughs> mm -hmm. Really good. I prefer the swordfish, oh, like but this one? is good too. What should I eat next? This one. I that is snapper. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. A lump of wasabi I didn't notice. <laughs> <laughs> it's all in my mouth. <laughs> my nose here, yeah, I feel like a dragon. <laughs> oh, I see baby eggs. Yes. I I ikura. Ikura. Yes. Oh, like how much? Ah, uh, yes. The same sounds, <laughs> but if we eat it with rice. <laughs> Babies. Salmon babies. You are eating salmon babies. No. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Wow, it's good though. Oh, I love Japanese egg. Mm -hmm. It's really sweet. Yeah. Compared to egg and something. Shells. I don't know. <laughs> but the. Mm. Mm. It's already good. So far, I like everything. <laughs> yeah. 
it's an uh, octopus, cooked octopus. Oh, Should okay. be eaten a bit chewy. It's very, very chewy from my experience. <laughs> Good. What do you do in Tokyo? So I'm modeling and sometimes acting on TV. Mm -hmm. And I also teach children cheer dance. Oh. I think Japanese children are so cute, so I love working with them. And in my free time, I teach English private lessons as well. Oh, I see. So many things. Uh, <laughs> so you enjoy Tokyo life? I love many many things about Tokyo life. There's always something to do, always places to go, and new fun things to experience. That's interesting. I love meat. <laughs> oh, so beef inside. I'm like, I remember when I first came to Japan, um, <laughs> I met someone on a date yep. and he took me to a horse izakaya. Oh. <laughs> but it was like, I was so recent, like I just came to Japan. It was really strange and he didn't tell me it was a horse izakaya. And then when we got there, he ordered everything and then it was all like this raw Meats. kind of meat and I was like what? It's <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's not good man I mean at least he should have told you like, about what and you then eat. he was like by the way this is horse meat <laughs> ah okay like then my mind wasn't so open because you know I've been living in England for all my life but this is like my pet. Yeah. <laughs> I know, different culture. Yeah, but after living in Japan for a while, I'm more open to trying new things. So like I've tried whale, raw meat. Yeah. So I'm always trying new things. Wow. Great. <laughs> So, so actually, I love shrimp, but... Not this type, right? <laughs> I don't know. Hmm? You can eat it like this. Like this. Mm. 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 Oh, I like it, but it's like half boiled. I don't know, it doesn't taste complete. Because it's still a little... The texture inside is still really soft. Mm -hmm. But it's good. Fried fish and fried sesame tofu. And some mushrooms on top. I love mushrooms. Yeah. <laughs> Come here. You can do it. <laughs> I feel so complete. <laughs> that is really nice. Yeah, great. When I eat delicious food, I always feel sleepy. <laughs> it's like, okay, I've eaten something nice, now just let me sleep. <laughs> I've never had fried sesame tofu before. Mm -hmm. My first time. Can I eat the mushroom? Yeah, of course. The whole thing. Right? Mm, not the whole thing. You can eat it. Oh, mushrooms. Mushrooms. Maitake. Maitake. Yes. Not shiitake. Not shiitake. It's good. It's dry though. Yes, it's I've never had this texture. Mm. You know what? I love tem tempura, mm. like the fried mushroom. Oh, fried. Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we ate delicious food. Yeah. <laughs> So what is like a Japanese traditional dessert? Um, 
red beans paste is uh, azuki. usually azuki is usually a traditional dessert. Mm. But at the green tea ice cream or something like that, matcha ice cream. I really like taiyaki. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> azuki taiyaki. Wait, I'm nervous to eat so well on camera because like Western people don't like like Japanese. It's just really silent. Like, but it's okay. You can eat like in your way. And it's uh, yeah, try the bonito, bonito face. Mm. Oh, I love it. And I love the cold that it's cold. Mm. Mm. It's really refreshing. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I like soba more than udon. Oh, yeah? How about ramen? Do you like ramen? Uh, I love um, <laughs> tonkotsu. Tonkotsu. It's all delicious, but tonkotsu is my favorite. Uh, so uh, I really want to go to Fukuoka. <laughs> Fukuoka. Yeah, tonkotsu land. Yeah, that's the best place to eat tonkotsu. I really want to go there so much. I'll eat tonkotsu every day. <laughs> Onion tofu. Oh, it's Are you four? Stuffed. <laughs> but even if you're four, you have another stomach for dessert. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Actually, I think that's like a Japanese saying. Yeah. Because we. Like, I never heard that in England, but when I came to Japan, everyone right. says that. Yes. <laughs> and I agree. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm not sharing this one. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. That's yours. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that, the strawberries are so sweet. And this also reminds me of a Chinese Yes, that's yes, same Chinese thing. Dessert, same thing. And in tofu. Mm. Mm. I love it. Where in England are you from? So, my town is really, really small, so maybe no one knows it, but it's called Burton Upon Trent. And it's close to Birmingham and Nottingham, it's kind of in the middle. Um, so it's yeah, yeah. not so far from London, about one and a half hours. So, if I go to your hometown, what should I try? For foods or for sightseeing, is there any like things you so, went? Beer was kind of from my hometown, so we have the a brewery museum. You can go and see that. Local beer breweries. Yeah, like we have a really really big brewery. Um, it's probably like the main place that has many many jobs for this town. Okay. Yeah. Other than that. Nothing. <laughs> Maybe better go to London. Yeah, yeah, you should just go there. Uh, I see. Yeah, because London is really great for museums. There's so many beautiful museums. Mm -hmm. If you're going, I would recommend to go to the Great British Museum. Oh. It's probably the most popular one in London and it has many, many sections for different cultures. Okay. Wow, sounds nice. Yeah, even it has like a whole Japanese section. Mm. Alright, thank you. You're welcome! Oishikatta! <laughs> <laughs> it was delicious. So you have an Instagram account? Yeah, please follow me on Instagram. Uh, Lia Pinku, L-I-A-P-I-N-K-U. Alright, I'll put it on the description of the video. Thank you! So, thank you so much. Bye-bye! Bye! -bye. Bye.